Hi, welcome to week 10. Uh, hope you've had a good break. I know this is uh, Monday morning after a 40 weekend, so it'll be difficult. Uh, and probably not a good timing for this chapter. Um, but we're starting to get into a little bit more information about the IP addressing schemes. Uh, so we've moved up the protocol. So we went from MAC addresses. Uh, you were introduced last week to routers and what they can do, what their functions, how to set them up, how to link them with uh, switches. Uh, but now you're going to look at, okay, how are we going to address them? Uh, so we're gonna, chapter 7, we'll be doing it over two weeks. Uh, this week we'll be talking about IPv4. Uh, so a little bit about numbering schemes, uh, how to de determine what you, information you can tell about an IP, P, IPv4 address prior to uh, uh, actually plugging anything in. I've plugged in a link to a subnet calculator, but I don't think we're going to subnetting, but I want to expose you to it a little bit uh, ahead of time. And then uh, some YouTube videos. Uh, if you click on YouTube videos, there are several different videos here. Uh, IP addressing, uh, network ID, subnet mass, IPv4 class, I classes. So there's several different view videos um, that I highly recommend that you review uh, during, uh, during this week. Uh, now the labs themselves are going to be... Uh, even though there's labs, they're not packet tracers, uh, but they're more hands-on activities as to converting different addresses. And my camera's going nuts. Okay. So you just have to bear with us this week. It's, it's, it's yeah, this whole chapter is kind of more uh, math and uh, definition than anything else. Uh, so just got to pay attention and uh, grin and bear it because when we get into Chapter 8 into subnetting, uh, you're going to want to know what Chapter 7 is and why it is the way it is. So again, you've got three labs, Reflection Journal, and because the chapter's over two weeks, you have no exam this week. Uh, now you still got to finish up the Chapter 6 exam. Uh, its deadline is probably on Wednesday. So... Hopefully that gives you a rough idea of what to expect this week. Good luck, and I will see you on Monday.